Alright, we're back. Um, we decided to help the shield bearers out. Who are you? So, hey, get over here. We're gonna give it a try. Oh, these are black blade mercenaries. Uh, we've been discovered. Run for it. Oh crap. This is where I have to go, though, right? How do I? How do I get by them? Who are you? I guess there has to be a way around. There we go. Got you your toxins. This is what caused the toxic mist. So it was not magic, but an alchemical concoction. We are in your debt. I'll have our physicians start researching how to make a neutralizing agent. Wait, would you consider destroying that sample now? On oh, yes. I understand the need for a cure for the poison. But I would like you to dispose of that sample. Find a method that ensures it can never again be used. You can incinerate it in the lava. Yes, I see. If there is no danger, the toxic mist will be used again. Then we have no need to neutralize it. That would also remove the temptation to use the sample to turn the tables on our enemy. I do not have the resolve to say with full confidence that we could prevail without it. Therefore, I will gladly do as you ask, Gwynvesta. Let us throw this master sample into the lava. I thank you for accommodating my request. I am happy that my words fell on wise ears. Commander Goodman, we have trouble! Uh-oh. What's wrong? What's going on? The enemy. They've launched the full scale of... Uh-oh. They attack with tremendous force. We may not be able to hold the line if they keep this up. You seemed okay up to now, though. What happened? They have begun using mithril ammunition. Mithril? About a year ago, the enemy captured the mithril mine we were working. There was something in my journal about that, come to think of it. Let's... I hear it. Is. Mithril is a hard metal refined from mithril ore, mined in Eisenbeer. Over 80% of all mithril in the world is mined in Eisenbeer, where it is said precious orichalcum has also been found. Orichalcum is a precious metal unique to Eisenbeer, and the hardest material in the known world. It can be used to produce weapons and armor of the highest strength, and it releases great energy when melted at high pressure. We tried to recapture the mine, but the sword bearers had put children to work down there. Children? Yes. I'm sure you've heard tales of canaries being taken into mines as an early warning for dangerous gases. Well, the sword bearers call the children they've abducted and forced into hard labor canary boys. When we tried to rescue the children, those cowards used them as human shields and barricaded themselves in Wow. That's crazy. Using these canary boys to warn of danger. I cannot believe the Black Blades would stoop to such tactics. Yep, they're all evil. Now you know it, dear. Despicable! Can't let them get away with it. We must do something to save the children. What are we waiting for then? Let's take back the Mithril Mine. The mines are crawling with sword bear soldiers. It would be foolhardy to rush in without support. Even so, we must take action. You can focus on retaking the mine. We'll rescue the children they're using down there. I seen that, uh... What Agnes did there. I could definitely see that she wasn't liking this. What can I help you with? Mercenaries. I'll fill you in on what we know about the Black Blade mercenaries. They have about 4,000 soldiers stationed in these lands. 
they are split into at least five units that we know of. The first, a unit led by the Swordmaster, the commander of the Black Blades. They are powerful, elite troops. Next is the unit that conquered the East City using Toxic Mist. We are very aware of the danger they represent. They have not been seen in recent years, which is cause for concern. Then there is their naval force. They are rarely sighted in battle. But after the Temple of Fire was attacked, there were reports they made several attempts to approach it from the sea. We also believe that the Black Blades has a covert unit specializing in assassination. Many shield-bearer officers have been slain in the past four years. We think this unit was also responsible for killing the Fire Vestal. Last of all, there is the unit led by someone I care not to mention. Huh? If you're around long enough, you'll learn all you need to know and more. Best to see for yourself. Okay. What can I help you with? Why this bridge? There's a good reason that the lines of battle were drawn at this bridge. Three roads run north to south across this land. One each to the east and west of here, and this one in between. The central road that this bridge is built upon is wider than the paths to the east and west, and it serves as our main thoroughfare. The colossal weaponry the Black Blades have given the sword bearers is too large to be hauled down any other road. I see. So the enemy was forced to target this bridge to make use of it? Precisely. We made this bridge our last line of defense, and the main body of the shield bearers guards it. The sword bearers need to cross the bridge so they cannot attack it directly. This strategy results in the least casualties for our forces. Smart. But even if you halt the advance of their main contingent, wouldn't it be easy for smaller units to slip past by other routes? Correct. Small squads we are not aware of present more danger than the vast army we face before us. Hmm. What can I help you with? What is that? What do you mean? The enemy forces attacking the bridge. Oh, I see. The shock troops led by that brassy young woman. Our intelligence suggests she is a high-ranking member of the Black Blades. That girl is one of their officers? Don't underestimate her. She uses the power of song to bolster her soldiers. Oh, is it that bunny lady? Arms. The power of song? Yes. Her songs can be quite troublesome. All of our soldiers that hear her sing become confused. The sword bearers bombard us from the opposite bank when they see us in disarray. We've suffered great losses from these attacks. Songs that inspire allies and confuse the enemy. She must have quite a voice. I'd like to hear it myself sometime. Oh gosh, ring a bell. So it doesn't bother you that she's a foe? I hope her honeyed tones sent you tumbling off the bridge. <sighs> I have no ulterior motives, I swear. So, if you silence this girl, would that swing the battle in your favor? Unfortunately, she is protected by a formidable force, and the narrow bridge makes it impossible to get close. Then, let us try. Good idea. Get myself a, um, another class, oh, for that matter. Is this the wind vessel we have here? What a delight! Oh, it is the bunny lady. Hey everyone! When you hear one of my numbers, we go wild! Oh gosh. And when you see me dance, we go wild! Oh snap. Oh, I'm kind of scared, but I want to enjoy the song as well. <laughs> oh gosh. Don't listen to her. She'll mess with your head. Let's do this. Let's go. They're strong. 
Ah. Don't they feel any pain? Nothing seems to face them. Okay, everybody. Time to back up a bit. The time is nigh to blow the sky high. Fire! Uh oh. We need to pull back now, or we'll be obliterated. No. I wanted to battle her and beat her. I'm afraid we weren't able to break through. If it is beyond even you, then we are out of options. If only we could shut... If only we could shut her up, exactly. Uh, maybe we will. Soon. One day. What's that? Out in the sea there. Definitely going out there. What's going on here? Hey, have you ever heard of a siren song? Nope. I have. A strange voice you hear out at sea, right? Sailors who hear the song become captivated by it and throw themselves overboard. It's a common tale. That's right. The siren song that causes all to cast themselves into the sea. When I was even younger than you are now, there was a time it was heard throughout the whole ship. A siren song? Was everyone okay? It caused great panic among young and old. But a traveling bard who happened to be aboard said something that calmed everyone down. All you have to oh. do is sing above the siren's voice. <laughs> Brilliant, isn't it? He conducted us in song with his baton all Night long, and the siren was defeated. Ooh, can we maybe use that on the girl? Wow, that's quite a story. Where did the bard go? Uh, who knows? He set off again soon after. One of the elders here might know. If we can use the bard to help us take down Praline, that might work. Oh yes, I heard that bard had peoples all over the world. When I was young, he must have been about my age now. I doubt he still lives. I remember him saying he was going to meet a pupil of his in Anchon. Ooh, alright. In Anchon. So off to Anchon then? Since he's, since the bard's like super old, his pupil might be able to help us stop uh, Praline's voice. Hey, it's the vessel of the wind. The wind to come back, haha, it's a miracle. What? 
I made the wind blow again. Wow. Yes, I was indeed Ark Pelar's first pupil. Sadly, I fear he has crossed the Great Divide. When he knows he was not long... When he knew he was not long for this world, he sought to visit three of his pupils one last time. He passed on to me one of the secrets to his singing. His last words to me were, Always sing with your mouth wide open. The second pupil he visited, I believe they lived near the castle in Caldisla. Caldisla. Okay. That's our next destination. Caldisla. Second people's here. You're looking for my old mentor. It has been some time since I heard his name. Such memories. Yes, it was his second people. When he came to see me, he looked fondly at my children, as if they were his own grandchildren. Now they're all grown up, and I am an old woman. Hmm? You wish to know if I was given any instructions? I do remember him saying, Sing from your belly. He stayed with me a few weeks, and set off to visit his third people. They lived in Florum, the land of radiant flowers. Okay. Off to Florum. Also... Level that up. Yes, I was his last people. Does that surprise you? You expected a woman, no doubt, me being from Florin. I can see it on your face. In any case, my mentor visited two other peoples before coming to see me. He bestowed one of the secrets to his songs to each of us. You wish to know what he told me? Well, this is embarrassing. He said, do not be shy when it comes to song. He always worried that I was too faint of heart. I'll never forget the words he whispered to me when he left my side from the last, for the last time. A singer has no need for fi of finesse. He said he was heading to Heartchild as he left. Okay, Heartchild. Let's head there. Jeez. 
ship and cross the ocean Dude, I don't care. I'm trying to exit. We're back in Heartchild. Let's hope uh, the master's here so he can instruct me on how to beat the frickin' bastard. Well, the beautiful lady. Yeah. Is this them? Mm -hmm. That old bard? Yeah, he passed on not ten years ago. Aww. About half a year after he arrived here, he gathered us little ones up and taught us about music. Always sing with your mouth wide open. Sing from your belly? Do not be shy when it comes to song? No, he never told us anything like that. But he did say your hearts are as one. And the most important thing is to have fun. It's not just me. All the people of this town were his peoples. As were their children. Even in the midst of this war, I bet you could convince the shield bearer soldiers to break into song. When he died, we sent his belongings on to Grand Ship. To Grand Ship. That was, that was the big ship, wasn't it? Do I have to go there now? Yeah, I do. Why couldn't they give me his belongings? They really have to send me on a journey around. Alright. Off the grand ship. Bard's baton? I wonder if we could borrow it for a while. Really? What for? I certainly don't mind, so take it. I doubt I'll ever get any use out of it. Thank you! Thanks. Hey, there's something written on it. The most important thing is to have fun, it says. Hmm. Huh. Okay. Now let's hope we can do this. I'm assuming we're going to conduct all the shield bearers to sing higher than her. And that way we can uh, block her out.
What can I help you with? Do battle again. We can take her now. The Wind Vessel and her merry band have graced us with their presence again. We haven't come to hear you sing, if that's what you think. Oh, please. Don't pretend you're not captivated by this voice of mine. Because we all know, when I sing... We go wild! Shut it! <laughs> you won't get your way so easily. Try as many times as you want, but it's futile. My personal guard would gladly die for me. Isn't that right, darling? We're here for you, Raylene! Thank you! Let's sing a little tune then! Love in the crossfire! Alright. We gotta block her out. Do something. Not so fast. Come on, you shield bearer! What are you doing? This isn't on the set list! <laughs> Ain't working. working. Time to blow you sky high. How's that? No way. It's useless. Ah, why are you being so mean? You're supposed to worship the ground I walk on. Girl, hit the wind vessel and that other rip out of here. Bring it. No more buff for you. All right. Let's take on um, Praline. Yep. I didn't even notice how that. Oh, wow. Default. Default. Okay. Default. Oh, gosh. Lucky we default. Oh. Okay. Brave. Fire boost and attack the black blade. Uh, brave. Piercing bolt. And blizzard. Uh. Default. Default. Get him. And poison. Nice. It's one down. First, we're going to try and mug her. Then attack, and... Oh, we're still repentant. Ow. Mm. Hang in there. Kiripedia. Um, hunt. No, not hunting. Use your Godspeed Strike. Nice. Ow. Alright, just just us, bunny lady. Let's default up. Let's see if we can default a good amount of people and just start unloading. Uh, ring a bell, you get healed. Oh, she brings more? That's not cool. Alright. Default. Default. Vengeance, offos, attack, no, attack her. She's gonna keep bringing more, there's no point. We can get rid of the Black Blade Man. 
and then uh, just continue battling her. Oh, what the hell? Get her. Love power. I hate your love power. Alright, um, let's sword magic thunder. Let's see. That's like more of her style of weakness. Uh, breathe a little bit. So we can deal some wind damage. Brave up like a nut. Get her. Finish her. Damn it. Come on. I'm trusting your low beam, Aaron. Raylene's got some power behind her, man. She just keeps coming and coming. Mm. Let's make sure we take out at least one of them. Default, default, default. die already. Piercing bolt. Brave up. Cure. Cure. And brave you up like a nut. No. Let's take her out. Or at least hope to try to. Come on. Oh no! They killed her. Damn it. I was just about to try and heal. And he's confused. Alright. Attack Praline. Since you can brave. We'll get that off of him. And then res her. Dia, are you? Ow.
attack, default, move up a little, Just hopefully get this cure off, please get this cure off. Oh, we beat her, yes. Right. There we go, nice. That's another class for us. A job class, yep. Yay! We got the entertainer, I think. Or the performer. Cool. completely. We should suffer much less attrition on the Eisen Bridge from now on. You've done us a great service. No problem. <laughs> All right. mind this here guys um on the next part we head to our main mission over there thanks for watching bye